Hello everyone, my name is Foley and welcome to Making Dreams Come True, episode 34. In the last episode, I got up to 2200 total level, getting my last 99 of the account, which was attack, and as well as getting 1000 next kills, in which I am almost 600 dry of a drop in my name and 300 of a drop in general. Will I continue to go dry at next? Will I finally see the shiny purple on the ground? Those and so many more questions will be answered in today's episode of Making Dreams Come True. And if you haven't yet, consider subscribing. It's totally free and it helps the channel grow and makes me feel good. But I hope you enjoy and thank you for watching. And there is level 98 mining. The last mining level I will get until I max this account. Now from uh, level 91 to 98, which is how long I've been doing my um, Amethyst, uh, it's took me about 300 hours of investment for this. So by far the longest skill that I will have to do for this account. Um, and I still have about, you know, 60 more hours to go. It is uh, kind of sad to, uh, to see this uh, skill going soon because... Uh, I do enjoy doing the Amethyst AFK, it's a pretty nice AFK activity and pretty good money. As you can see, I am at 192,000 dart tips now. Like I said in the last episode, once I get this stack up to 200,000, I am going to start fletching them and then I'm going to do a whole comparison about how much money I uh, end up losing on them. But great way to start off the episode, another 98 in the books. Level 96 fire making. And there it is. 1,031 kills, that means I am officially 600 dry of a drop in my name. Oh my god, I saved my whole fucking team, dude, that was fucking clutch. <laughs> I know it's a bit out of like, context, but like, uh, I saw my friend Lily doing uh, her first fight cave, so I wanted to go get a kill, and so I, I got a kill, and this is what happened. Game, but I am speedrunning the fuck out of this game. Oh, 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 no. <laughs> no okay. fucking way. Yeah, yeah. No, you're just different. Yeah. You're just different. Oh, no, you're just different. my God. I see. Yeah. I hate you so much. This is what happens when you leave next, bro. You just get drops in other Dude, places. every time I leave next, something nope. happens, bro. At the side, oh. Four kill count. Yes, you, you heard that right. Which is honestly just crazy. This is off task, so it was a 1 in 200 of me getting it, and I got it in, uh, in four kills, which is really cool. I I, I have wanted this, uh, wanted to go get this pet at some point. Um, I thought it was going to be far in the future before I went to do that. I guess I didn't even have to try to get it. So uh, I guess that's cool. I'm still dry at next though. Seems like every time I leave next, something happens. It's crazy how that works, right? Oh my God, finally the dry streak fucking is gone. I was almost at 300 kills. Oh my god, thank god. It's a dupe, but I will fucking take it. Oh, thank god. Thank god. Oh, it's about damn time. Over 600 dry of a drop in my name and almost 300 dry of a drop in general. Here we go. I'm just going to put them in for whatever they are going to sell for. All right, and they sold for 163 million. Oh, this is nice. I have been so broke, so this money is gonna it's gonna do me real good. It's gonna do me real good. All right, let's give the money to the boys. The split will be 54 million each. All right, and we get ourselves 54 million as well. Hell yeah, dude. My my cash stack's been under 10 mil for for a while, so uh, it's glad to see the green stack back. Let's go. Okay, so I've been on my phone all day, and I got up to 200,000 Amethyst Dart Tips. Totaling up to 138 million, I'm going to do some RD Rooftops. Watch these Dart Tips while I do the Rooftops. Level 92, Level 93, Level 94, and Level 95 Fletching. I also gained 372,000 Agility XP along with 3 million Fletching XP. And I still have 55,000 Amethyst Dart Tips to go. So I'm going to try to bang that out tonight. And there is a level 96 Fletching. Oh my god, and here we go. Right at the end of the night, 
I got one more Fletch to do, and then I will have Fletched all 200,000 of these Amethyst darts in one day. I'm actually pretty proud of myself for doing that, but here we go. But we are adding a, another 118,000 to the Agility XP, which puts us up to just around 500,000 XP for the day, which is fucking crazy. I think that's my all-time high for a day. And then another 1.1 mil in Fletching XP, which totals out to 4.1 mil Fletching XP for the day. Overall, a very, very successful day. Now, the dart tips were worth 138 mil and some change, and... These 200,000 amethyst dart tips cost 75.9 mil. So we lost about 60 mil off of that. Well, I guess I didn't lose 60 mil because I never spent the money anyways. So um, this is my profit from doing amethyst mining. And uh, yeah, I'm actually pretty proud of that. Uh, 300 hours for like 4.1 million XP in fletching plus... I don't know, it was like probably 1 to 1 1.5 mil in crafting XP as well as all the mining XP. And I also get like 76 mil on top of it. I'll take that any day of the week. But yeah, let me go to the Grand Exchange and uh, and sell these. Okay, so I believe I have single-handedly flooded the market. Um, yeah, the sale is not moving, so I guess I'm just going to keep this in overnight. I really don't feel like dropping down the price any lower. If I get on tomorrow and they still all haven't sold, then I'll drop the price down, but I'll just keep these in for the night. Oh, I also forgot to mention it. Um, all these Marks of Grace, the 207, I got all those today while doing arty. So almost a full graceful outfit right there just from today, which is pretty cool. All right, it is the next day and all the darts have sold off. So there is our 74 million after taxes, of course, which is going to bring us up to a total of 93 million. Now, if we look at our skills real quick, there's only a few skills left that I have to get to level 95. So I think that is going to be my goal for this video is to get every skill at least to 95. So I think I am going to start off with a, a bit more room crafting. I kind of fell off there at the end of last video with the room crafting training. It's just because I was uh, getting so dry at next that I felt the need to just stay there until it happened. But I'm going to start picking that back up. Yeah. Okay. Well, while Victor's casing, I'm actually going to stock up too. No. <laughs> well, I'm sorry. I'm fire. <laughs> no. I'm sorry, bro. Bro, I'm I'm on a fucking groove. Why? I'm fucking I've been killing it, bro. Damn, 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 damn. Oh my! Wait, no, you're on a groove, bro. What? Come on. The and you're gonna mess that all second. up. You're messing yeah. it all up. No. Speaking of come, <laughs> you guys bring the worst out in me. Yeah. I see. And you put the best in me. I mean, what? Sir! <laughs> what? My wife is next to me. Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, no. Yeah. Oh, no. Yo, 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 yo. Maxi poo. No, 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 no. Not no, like no, this. No, 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 no. Not like no. this. Surely not this way, right? I'll reset. Yep. Don't worry. Surely, surely, surely. Really? Okay. Ah, okay. I didn't know. Yeah. Ah. Okay, I'm not eating. By the way, I'm gonna chance it. Maybe she'll. You're gonna. Me. You're gonna chance 300 KC. Yep. Yep. Oh! 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 No! 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 I'm taking it to you guys. No! What had, the fuck, bro? Eat. I was. I was scared. Oh, I was you scared. Fucking I pussy. Couldn't, bro. You pussy. I couldn't. No, I, I had to you. eat. Yeah, I am. I'm scared. I see. I was scared. I was scared. Oh, okay. that's probably a 100. Yep, 110 to the dome. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. My okay, God. I need you. I need you to run. I need you to run away. Uh, yeah, yeah, right, oh. yeah, yeah. Okay, good. good oh, good, I'm, good, dead, good, I'm dead. Good, I'm dead. I'm dead. <laughs> good, good, good. Oh no! Oh, oh, oh. I'm dead. Okay. You know, for you, Foley, I'm fighting to the death. I'm fighting to the death. Wait, wait, do I have altar? No, I don't. Fuck, I don't even have prayer, bro. Um, I'm just gonna watch it while blowing some glass. Okay, can you see this? Already? I thought you were staying till the end. Huh? I thought you were staying till the death. Oh. You, you lied to me. You liar. You liar. 
You fucking scoundrel. I didn't have prayer fully. fully. You fucking scoundrel. Fine, fine, fine. 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 Here's what's gonna go. Here's what's the fine. Here, 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 here. I'm about to die to a reaver. I don't have any... <laughs> no, 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 don't, don't, no, no, no. I'm already outside. I'm already oh, outside. No, don't, don't, don't. No! Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! <laughs> that melee fucking womped your ass with a special attack. It's okay. Little update, I just hit 300 million total XP. That's kind of a cool goal to hit. And also, I am going to be buying 100,000 more Amethyst Dart Tips. Now from 98 from where I'm at to like 99, I'm going to obtain about 28,000 more Amethyst Dart Tips. Meaning I'm going to need about 100,000 more um, to 99 fletching. So I am going to slow buy these. Yeah, that is the goal to slow buy them because these things can uh, rack up in price. But I'm just going to leave them in the grand exchange. Okay, so it's been a couple days since my last clip. But I just, uh, I'm doing it again. I fucked up last time. I'm fucking doing it again. So I got fletching edge. I got agility um, pretty much edged. I'm getting some agility right now while doing, uh, some barbarian fishing. I'm doing barbarian fishing right now. I'm gonna edge that skill. I got smithing edged. I'm working on thieving here and there, and, uh, fire making and cooking are on their way up there, too. I think I'm gonna try to get all those skills plus construction and craft and hunter edged up. I know it's, uh, completely unnecessary, but I just want to practice. I don't want to fuck up at the end, so I'm just practicing now to make sure I got the art down. But you may be asking why I am doing barbarian fishing when I was doing Temperos, and that is just simply because um, I'm running out of AFK things to do. So I think I'm going to make that transition because I can't necessarily AFK at Temperos. But when I do want to actively train, I will go back there. And it has been like four days since I last uh, recorded a clip, but I did end up getting fishing all the way leveled up pretty much as well as herb lore, fire making, and runecraft. I am now going to work on uh, thieving, cooking, hunter, and construction. Uh, probably some cooking first. Oh my god, I did it on accident. I wasn't even paying attention. I was watching this fucking video. God damn it. Well, there's 98 cooking. Oh well. I still have uh, a decent amount of skills uh, edged, so... That is a plus side. Okay, so I started off my day on the cellular device and I uh, just AFK'd some thieving. So I got that done already. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, get this 1 million hunter XP. Hopefully I can get it today. We'll, we'll see. Um, the goal is to at least get the hunter done today. If not, if I get hunter done today, then um, definitely getting construction done as well. Then I'll level all these up tonight if, uh, if I'm able to do that. So let's uh, let's go ahead and get started. We're uh, we're in for like six hours of a uh, hunter, probably. <clears throat> I see. I see. I uh, I got distracted by my dog, and I let this guam tar be made, and it gave me a herbore level. <laughs> so there is a ninety-eight herb lore. Yay! <laughs> All right, there we go. Six hours later, 1 million hunter XP has been gained. So I ended up banging out the construction too in the same day. And I was actually streaming this to a couple of friends. So um, I actually didn't do any voice recordings while I got all the levels. But uh, I do have the footage. So here we go. <laughs> As you can see, uh, I just got it. I was just in a call with some friends, but there we go. 94 agility, 96 thieving, 92 smithing, 98 fire making, 98 fletching, 96 fishing, 95 runecrafting, 94 construction, and 97 hunter. 
There we go. And we did it all uh, without fail. I I'm just kidding. We did fail the uh, herb lore and the fire make, not the fire making, the cooking, but that is all right. Again, this is all just practice for the end of the count. We're actually 2239 total level now. And now most of my skills are now at the uh, no progress bar, which uh, um, motivates me slightly to start training them some more. I actually do plan on maxing here on Fossil Island because there's just so many uh, training activities you can do here. So my mic wasn't working, but the next day I ended up going and doing agility for a lot of the day. Got 300,000 XP and uh, had enough to go buy a new set of Graceful and I decided to make it into the Lovakinch set for no apparent reason. Uh, spent the beginning of the day doing a couple hours of agility, got me 54 more marks of grace and a little over 100,000 agility XP, so we're over halfway to uh, level 95 now. And something I didn't mention whenever I uh, chain leveled all those skills is uh, we actually have 9 98s now, which is uh, pretty cool to see that uh, skills page is really filling up. And one notable skill level was uh, 95 runecrafting. As you can see, I can now make wrath runes, which I think I am going to do until I am 99 runecrafting. So I want to actually go do some wrath runes right now. I want to see what the XP rates are and how much profit I can be making an hour and all that stuff. And I guess I'll let you all know that. Now, the setup is uh, a little different from uh, when I was making blood runes. Um, for wrath runes, you're going to be running through a bunch of dragons. So you want to bring a... Uh, a dragon fire shield, anti dragon shield, uh, wh whatever type of dragon fire protection shield that you got. And I'm also wearing a blood fury just to be a little more tanky. Um, other than that, I'm not bringing the blood essence um, for obvious reasons. Um, but instead, I'm bringing a mythical cape because that is what is going to take me over to the dragons. So I am going to be using the mythical cape for teleport uh, to the dragons. I'm going to be using the same Moon Clan teleport to bank, and then whenever I do need to recharge on run energy, I will do a, uh, I will go over to the house. That way, I don't have to use any precious stamina pots. But let's go ahead and get started and see what an hour of this is like. Okay, so right off the bat, uh, you're gonna teleport to the Myth Guild, and you're gonna enter this statue. And if you have the uh, the camera pointed the way I do, then um, immediately south there will be a cave. You can just one click run to it, which is uh, pretty nice. Uh, that is the really nice thing uh, about this compared to blood runes, because blood runes you got to enter multiple like crevices and stuff. So there's a, a lot of constant clicking, but with wrath runes it's a little more AFK. The routes are actually shorter though, so I guess it evens out in the end, but. Uh, still you won't be uh, clicking as much. And then you just go over and make your blood runes and then rinse and repeat. So, um, yep, just another hour of that and I will uh, keep you all updated. All right, the hour has passed. 35,000, so just a little bit less. Actually, I, I mean like 5K less experience per hour compared to blood runes. But let's see what uh, let's see what the money looks like. 7,000 wrath runes, 1.5 mil. So I guess it's about the same, maybe a little bit more than blood runes, but... Uh, yeah, the blood essence definitely helped chunk that number up, but there is a cost to that. So um, I never really calculated in the cost of the blood essence at the end. So I would say Wrath Runes is a little bit more money. Anyways, I will I will be doing that until 99. What I did notice, though, is I have to go out of my way to get stamina with my house teleport. So I think, um, I mean, the only other alternatives are um, just chugging stamina potions and i don't really want to do that or i could get the desert amulet 4 and um have a teleport directly to narda that will be a faster teleport for restoration when i need it so i am going to look into that and see if that is something i can do within a timely manner five minutes later this might be a dying angle oh my god Ooh, oh 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 eat that ray eat that ray eat the ray okay um there you go. You got this. We, you got this. You got this. How do we maneuver this? Uh, right there. You just stand still. Yep. I believe in you. Just yep, keep look, look, Yep. Yep. Look at those no, hits. Look at those hits. Oh. Come oh. On. <laughs> Get ready. That teleport ready. <laughs> oh, look at that big hit. Okay. 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 My man's cooking. I'm chancing it. I'm chancing yep. it. You got it. 
No! 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 Hey, Foley. What's up? You wanna hire me to boost you? No. I'll do it by myself. I see. I'm too poor, bro. I spent all my money on this Dragon Warhammer. Oh. No, I wasn't gonna say that. I was just gonna say, give me all your regular loot, buddy. I could come and spec, spec you, you know, spec transfer and heal the other. And you just want my Bring regular you supplies. Loot. Oh! A lot of group iron oh. in this motherfucker. Oh, Dragon oh, Warhammer. Nice. Yeah. Well, yeah, yeah, brother. Oh, there you go. <laughs> I guess I'll have oh, to give it up. Gonna... 45. Oh. Oh my. Ooh, Wait, what? Sword. What the hell? <laughs> what is... Wait, you're... Co... <laughs> 59 you're a... kills? You're okay. collection logging. What right. is going on? All right. Okay, what's we'll it? No, you're we'll crazy. Take Your luck is... Wait, what? <laughs> no. Yeah. What's wrong with you? Can you live with that? Or Can no? I live? Brother. Um, if you heal uh, me again, I can live. Oh, okay, wait. Let me actually think. Oh, look, I got a brew that you gave me. I'm gonna heal so that I could heal you. Yep. Okay. Okay. Wait, I just realized big I don't brain, have a magic brain. now because I don't have a restart. I just feel like big I don't have a magic brain, big brain now because I don't have a restart. Oh, there we go. We got the KQ head. Hell yeah. All right. Kill count 126, so pretty much right on rate for it. Uh, that is what I'm talking about. Uh, I've spent like the better part of like seven hours here today. So uh, actually, shout out to Jer. He uh, he uh, um, was running supplies for me for a decent uh, amount of time. So shout out to him. I, I let him keep all the drops that I got while he was helping me out. So um, which included the uh, dragon pickaxe and the uh, dragon uh, two-handed sword. Well, since I'm here, I might as well uh, go ahead and get another kill. And for those who do not know, KQ is basically just, hey, take damage type of boss. So uh, really, all you got to do is tank all the damage you can. Um, whenever you need to heal, just step under her and eat as much as you need to, and then step back out and start attacking again. The first phase, I use the Karis Partisan, um, and then the next phase, I just use Blowpipe. So it's a uh, that's pretty much how I do it. There's some uh, better methods with more expensive gear that I do not have. All right, and there we go. It killed that uh, KQ just because I had the supplies for it, a super restore drop, and some buckets of sand. All right, well, uh, now that I got the KQ head, I'm going to go ahead and install it into the POH and then finish the rest of the Desert Diaries real quick. Uh, and that way I will have the uh, Desert Amulet 4 for my uh, Wrath Rune making needs. Build head trophy, uh, KQ head, um, and we'll talk to the head, and there it is. The Desert Elite Diaries is now completed. Let's go get our reward. Blah, 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 give me reward. Thank you very much. Okay, so, um, the most important thing about the Desert Elite Diary is the, uh, the amulet itself. It's gonna give you unlimited teleports to, uh, Narda, which is a very fast teleport. I mean, I'll do the teleport right now. Very fast teleport right to an altar that will give you your health and everything back. It acts the same as, uh, your uh your pools in the poh so uh it's a uh, pretty handy and it actually costs nothing where these uh, house teleports can actually start racking up in cost other than that you get a uh, free access through the shanty pass um so you don't have to buy any more shanty passes you get the shortcut for the cow fight lair which i mean i'll end up using whenever i go to uh get the pet or something from cow fight queen but not anytime soon um, and yeah, we get this 50,000 XP lamp as well. All right, and we're going to put this lamp directly into agility. You already know. 50,000 agility experience. Thank you very much. Okay, so I'm at the end of the night here, and I uh, just wanted to turn off brain after doing KQ for so long, so I just stuck around at thieving for a little bit. Um, 220,000 XP, but that will do it for the night. Okay, it is the next day. I am all recharged up. Um, I did mention earlier that I wanted to get base 95s, so I am going to go ahead and get this construction level, and then after that, I think I'll work on some smithing. There we go, level 95 construction. All right, here we go, level 93 smithing. All right, last inventory. It's been almost 
five hours since I entered this blast furnace, but here we go. Level 94 smithing. I think that is going to do it for me for the night. Uh, almost 1.5 million uh, smithing XP today, and it actually goes by pretty fast, decently. Yep, we are uh, just uh, two total levels off of uh, base 95s, one agility and one more smithing level, and we're actually getting pretty close to that agility level, so I say within the next few days we should have that done. And here we are the next day, uh, about three and a half hours later, and we have level 95 smithing, so uh, just agility to go. Oh, and here we are after hours and hours of doing some arty. I have officially gotten level 95 agility. It is the next day now, actually. Um, I decided to do some uh, Slayer after I got that smithing level. So uh, got about 400,000 Slayer XP left. Uh, nothing special happened there. Just a couple of like blood velds, vampires. I did get a Necreals task, but nothing too interesting happened. But I also decided to make the rest of these Amethyst darts that I purchased earlier in the video. So we got about 500k left in Fletching XP, which uh, the Amethyst that I get from mining should cover that. We are now base 95s. So that is a uh, very cool. I just look at the stats page and I, I feel like I'm getting so close, but I know that I am still actually kind of a long ways off. There's still uh, lots more to grind. But anyways, I think I'm going to end the video off here. If you made it all the way to the end, I appreciate you. And uh, if you like the video, make sure to subscribe so you can see when I put out more videos in the future. My name is Foley and I will see you guys on the next one.